friends, I am Lily Gedding from Anand Rati and we are back with our weekly podcast episode with Mr. Nilesh Jain, Derivatives and Technical Analyst at Anand Rati. Thank you Nilesh for joining in the podcast series to share your market outlook for the week. So Nilesh, how are the markets looking on charts and what are the momentum indicators indicating? Hi Lily. Well, the markets remain extremely volatile throughout the week where Nifty started the week on a negative note. and rebounded sharply after hitting the lows of 11185 the nifty index is showing resilience and every decline is getting bought into the nifty index after making a swing high of 11794 it was making a lower top and lower bottom formation on the daily chart which has now been negated and nifty has also reclaimed its short term 21 day moving average which is placed at 11410 levels which is a positive sign on the high side it has an immediate barrier of 11500 and till the time it doesn't break above the same we can expect some sort of a consolidation in the range of 11300 to 11500 if nifty manages to surpass 11500 levels then we can expect further momentum towards 11600 and 11650 the momentum indicators and oscillators are very much in the buy mode on a weekly scale which indicates that the overall undertone is remains on a positive side the volatility index in the weeks which fell by 6% to end below 21 levels and the overall cooling off in the volatility index is giving comfort to the bulls and a further drop from here on will pull the index on the higher side now if we look at the structure for the bank nifty which remained under pressure throughout the week and also underperformed compared to the nifty index it has formed a small bearish candle on the weekly scale and if you look at the daily chart of the bank nifty it has formed a two consecutive doji candle pattern which hints of a potential reversal from the lower levels and a decisive move beyond 22700 levels will provide further momentum towards 23000 and 23400 in the coming weeks the major support for the bank nifty is placed at the psychological level of 22000 as long as it trades above 22000 levels the overall structure for the bank nifty is looking slightly positive side overall we are expecting some sort of a pause in the nifty and bank nifty may outperform from here on can you share your few observations about nifty open interest levels for the coming week well on the derivative front a huge amount of put riding was seen at 11400 and 11300 strike although the higher amount of open interest is still placed at 10500 levels which is far otm strike we believe that going forward we might see shifting of open interest towards the levels of 11300 to 11400 strike in the coming week the immediate support based on the data is coming at 11300 strike uh, fresh call reading was also seen at 11500 which also hold the maximum open interest on the call side which will act as an immediate hurdle if nifty breaks above 11500 then we can expect some short covering rally towards the levels of 11600 so the overall option data indicates a tug of war between call and put writers and we can expect nifty to oscillate in the range of 11300 to 11600 in the coming week so nilesh tell me since markets are very volatile what kind of strategy would you recommend to trade in the index Right Lily uh, looking at the volatility it is not advisable to trade in the futures without any hedge so we have formulated two sets of strategies uh, the first one is for aggressive traders and as we have said that bank nifty may outperform from here on so one can deploy a pair trade strategy where one need to buy three lot of bank nifty futures and simultaneously sell two lot of nifty futures so the overall ratio of bank nifty to nifty which is currently as 1.93 and the previous multi months low which is placed at 1.90 is likely to act as an immediate support so we can expect this ratio to move higher towards the levels of 1.98 to 2 also the second set of strategy is for defensive traders to capture the up move in the bank nifty the defensive traders can initiate a bull call spread in the coming weekly expiry where one can buy one lot of 22600 bank nifty strike at 302 
simultaneously sell one lot of bank nifty 23000 strike at 150 so the total outflow from this strategy would be 152 point as per the closing price on friday the maximum profit of 248 points could be gained if bank nifty expires at or above 23000 levels the break even of this strategy would be 22752 the maximum loss would be limited to the premium paid as always, thank you Nilesh for sharing your valuable inputs with us.